chicken and corn. What's going on, y'all? This is Tucker Pacino. Look, Dad Baby uh, posted a picture of her with micro braids today. And she caused a lot of, you know, a lot of uh, controversy with that. Um, the first post that she did was that. I can't play that music, but uh, this is what she wrote. Uh, I want to deeply apologize to everyone whose life has seriously affected by the way I wear my hair from the bottom of my heart I wanted to tell you to suck my dick I hate when girls say that shit but remember she's trying to mimic y'all and you know the fuck I'm talking about when I say y'all anyway and yes apparently I guess I have really affected <laughs> wow affected <laughs> like life's I can't like lives life's I can't figure out another reason why anyone would take out the time of that day to write a paragraph and bully someone about hair. And by the way, whoever wanna come pull up, like I said, like they said, you got my location, I ain't hide, ooh. And then, uh, anyway. So, I wanna get to the, uh, the story part. And I wanna, uh, let me see if I can screenshot and we can go over it and read it because you, you don't have too much time to read it on here right let me see and there goes a picture of her so uh one second here all right so here we go she said to all the black females that are saying my hair ain't me <laughs> ain't meant for box braids I, this girl need to go and get an education because she don't know how to type. But <laughs> guess the fuck what y'all hair ain't meant to be straight, but y'all glue whole wigs and on to your head and so Brazilian, Indian, and Peruvian hair, which isn't anything. My God, typos. Like your natural hair texture at all. And, and I don't say a goddamn thing, neither do the other cultures that you get the hair from. And on top of that, I'm not one of the people who has ever made fun of or said anything about, bad about girls with box braids or type of braids. I completely agree that would, that would be out of line and cultural appropriation if I was trashing black girls from wearing braids, then them getting them. <laughs> but that's not the situation at all. So leave me the fuck alone. And I'm going to start getting real disrespectful. I love the way I look. Plus, your man agrees. We all know I look fine as fuck with any hairstyle. If I, I do from any culture because I'm just that bitch. How old is this girl now? She ain't, She's not grown yet. She's still like underage, right? Anyway. Like we ain't been seeing this since she was what 15, 14, 13. I don't know how old she is. I hope y'all bald headed. Oh wow. I hope y'all bald headed old stay up all night thinking about this. <laughs> me, me and my brain's gonna sleep real good. Good night. <laughs> oh black women, man, the motherfucker today. Anyway. LOL, I knew the internet would find a way to flip what I was saying. So first of all, my comment was not directed toward all the black women who wear straight hair, only towards the black women who were saying I was trying to be black because I was wearing braids. All I did was say back to them what they said to me by saying that they want to be like other cultures for wearing straight Peruvian, Indian, and other hair types. It's dumb to me to say that, huh? But why is it okay for someone to accuse me of doing something I'm not? But when I do the same, the exact same thing back, I'm wrong. And by the way, I didn't call black women bald headed either. 
that was in a whole different comment that was made all, that was made about all the people who also had something to say about me there was there was multiple other races too even some white women who were accusing me and no I do not personally feel offended if black women wear the straight wig and never even said that I don't know where the fuck y'all get some of this shit from like what why would I be bothered by the way another girl decided to wear their hair that shit ain't got she keeps spelling ain't A-N-I-T does she really know that know how to spell ain't and that ain't even how you type the word like that's not even grammar but I, I, that's digress ain't is A-I-N-T come on girl come on anyway got nothing to do with me as long as she feels she looks good who the fuck cares it's just fucking hair but that's twisting people's words and shit ain't oh my god gonna work with me I'ma always make sure you know exactly what what the fuck I mean when I saw when I say something I, I think the wire is cut off I guess say something <sighs> well bad baby uh has called out the black women in question that tried to say that she's co- cultural appropriation, cultural pro- appropriate, cultural appropriating braids in her hair as a Caucasian female. And I would, even though this girl is very ignorant in her grammar, her misspelled words, and her raunchy, ratchet behavior that, if we really want to be honest, here, she's mimicking the black girls that act that way. So she, she's gotten your identity. And she's learned how to act like you by watching y'all. Because this is not how she was raised. So you're not saying she's cultural appropriating. Making songs like high bitch and acting all ghetto until she put the brace in. You know, she caused a lot of controversy. I think that is hypocritical and ignorant of black women who have a problem with their girl wearing braids. Because she made an excellent point that you women who do wear weaves and you know Indian hair and all this other different your hair is not meant to be straight she has a point she's a hundred percent factual and there's no arguing that I'm gonna leave it at that let's talk to Pacino hey like she said I hope I hope, said, I hope y'all stay up all night we're gonna sleep good with my box braids and I love it Maybe this will put y'all in y'all place because she's right and you can't argue with that. And they try to twist the words up because now you want to make her seem like she's a bad person when she's already a bad person in her behavior. Do you want to say she's racist? Is that y'all try to twist that around now? Stop it. Anyway, I'm out.